what we've said is, let's take another trillion of that that we raise through a reforms in the tax system that allows people like me and, frankly, you, Mark, for paying a little more in taxes. Um, I'm cool with that. I know you're okay with that. Um, <laughs> keep in mind, what we're talking about is going back to the rates that existed when Bill Clinton was president. Now, uh, a lot of you uh, were... Uh, <laughs> I'm trying to say this delicately, still in diapers at that time, but... Uh, um, but the, uh, for those of you who recall, uh, the economy was booming. And wealthy people were getting wealthier. There wasn't a problem at that time. If we go back to those rates alone, that by itself would do a lot in terms of us reducing uh, our overall spending. And if we can get a trillion dollars on the revenue side, two trillion in cutting spending, we can still make investments in basic research. We can still invest in uh, something uh, we call ARPA-E, uh, which is like DARPA, except just focused on energy, it, so that we can figure out what are the next breakthrough technologies that can help us uh, reduce our reliance on fossil fuels. Uh, we can still